Um, the other ingredients I have here is dried sheet nori. Uh, it's in sheets like pieces of paper. Get these at your local Asian shops. Support the Asian shops, especially during coronavirus uh, years. There's a lot of racism out there. So support your local Asian shops. Um, so the classic onigiri includes umeboshi, which is Japanese pickled plums. They're actually not plums, they're apricots, but I don't know why everyone calls them pickled plums. It's called umeboshi in Japanese. Um, they're salted and they're very sour. Uh, if you get the kind that has honey in it, uh, which is hachimitsu umeboshi, honey umeboshi, then it's a little less sour and tart. Uh, it's a country food, um, but it's very traditional. It's good for your stomach. So if you have stomach ailments, um, this is where to go to. At the same time, there's a high salt content. So um, if you're on a low sodium diet, not the best thing. Speaking of sodium, here is some salt in a bowl. And here is the umeboshi. Um, I've just basically halved, this is a whole one. And I've just pull, pulled them apart into halves. So I'll just put a half in, in the center of each umeboshi. Um, you have to be, warn people that there are umeboshi pits inside, otherwise they'll break their teeth open. So in this second bowl, I'm gonna put in some cold water. 